unfortunately, you're having a harder time um, calculating the telemetry for the center of the distortion since all the ship's computers are now turned into Apple II E. Uh, Apple II, easily uh, do diameter and pi r squared. Yeah, but so can uh, um, lined paper. <laughs> I mean, so can our Android that somehow hasn't degraded with the distortion. Hey, don't give my ideas. <laughs> 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 turns out, turns out, there are upsides to temporarily contracting fourth dimensional space gonorrhea. <laughs> there we go. He now exists. He now exists partially outside of the flow of time. Also, also, you know what that means? Like, it means technically, the captain did have his way with me. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it. That's why we said not yet at that time. There are three things you can't avoid. Warp space, taxes, and sex with a captain. And Captain Darcy. <laughs> yes, in fact, Captain Darcy does in fact fuck the android next Tuesday, but it already happened in the past. It's confusing. <laughs> Don't ask questions. <laughs> Tuesday. <laughs> Tuesday, Tuesday. Every day is Tuesday. <laughs> So, how are you going to figure out where the center is? You need to come up with your plan. I want to si science help. again. Oh, I can't Android help. Android can't help. The Android is far too busy having a carefully choreographed training montage set from various camera angles of slow-mo cuts and everything. Also, for some reason, there's now a box, that there's now a punching bag hanging over the treadmill, and the Android's punching it also. Are you doing a Pyagorium theory? To go, over, to go over Newton's law of gravitational Newtons <laughs> uh, with the force of one android on a horse treadmill and two pass out horses. Um, can I figure out where the pirate's base of operations is? I'm surprised you didn't try and use like a like a dividing rod from the body parts we got earlier. <laughs> <laughs> I just have two hands as the dividing rod, or two arms. Two, two you sit down to the Apple II and begin writing your custom program to calculate your space bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> Roll a 1d6. Everyone knows you need a much better computer than that to calculate hyper bullshit. I got four. However... <laughs> With vim and vigor and some haggis on the side, you force the, the Apple II to give you a result that is close enough. The answer it gives you is turquoise. That that turns out you. Know, however, you understand what that really means, and you punch that into the hyperspace warp drive. Not turquoise, but the numbers that you know it meant to say. Buckle up, boys. <laughs> We're heading out of town. Unfortunately, close enough is not always good enough. You don't land next to the planet. You land crashed into the planet as you come out of hyperspace. God damn it. Yeah, that's close enough. Welcome. That's some fuck some shit up, boys. Okay. Good job, Mr. Engineer. Good job, Engineer. You just broke the shit. <laughs> And we're right where we needed to be. <laughs> yeah, we're well, we're well armed. Actually, no, we have we have shields. As you look up, you can see the space pirates are doing what anyone does once they go Super Saiyan. They're all screaming at each other and flying around with spiky hair, punching each other. I found them. <laughs> found them. Right, can we detonate the warp core and take them all out? No, we have to survive for the captain. Because Wednesdays the are my is, days. The captain exists in fourth dimension. He'll survive. Yeah, but we won't. What about what about um just beam, beaming them into space or into a black hole or something? Oh, black covered, hole, yeah. they can we breathe in the space, space. but they can't the breathe in a black hole. Yeah, well, they might not. It might not work for the black hole though. <laughs> Unfortunately, your ship's kind of messed up. The warp drives, aren't, your teleporters aren't working at all right now. You'd have to repair the whole ship. We have an engineer. Can we generate a black hole? You just want mass destruction! <laughs> What's but how's that any worse than 
fucking our engineer. No, 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 you went legs. You went, you went from like, let's talk to the Amish people. Maybe I could talk some sense to die, everybody. Okay. okay. Well, you know, you learned, you learned, you learned from my <laughs> actions. <laughs> what, what your goal has always been is to sleep with aliens. Guess what? They're aliens. We need what is in their butt. So do your job. Oh shit! Oh, that is right. that is logic. Right. That... He's right. You haven't slept with stay in space pirates yet. That is logical. Am, am I am I affected with the space gunnery? Yes, everybody is. Oh, them. then they will be too them. soon. No, I'm, no, I, you are. You actually are not infected yet. No, well, come here, big boy. Captain Darcy. Or you can say, or you can say the time, the time shift uninfected him. No. Or maybe, maybe we're immune because we've all slept with him. Oh, that's true. That's, no, you're right. You all, you've been all been rolled back to a time before you slept with Darcy. Except for me. And then wouldn't Darcy get rolled back to a time before he contracted it? Maybe he's patient. No, he's got. He's got. Darcy. Darcy fucked a fourth dimensional being where, where their yeah. sex existed at all points in time simultaneously. So yeah, he's stuck. Okay. He got the super AIDS. I missed my itch, guys. <laughs> okay. Okay, soldier, go go do your thing. So how are you gonna get the attention of those Saiyans up there, those Saiyan space pirates with their I'm going to eat. pirate I'm going to eat. hats and their flint locks and their sabers? Having screaming fights in the air, in the sky. How are you going to get their attention? I'm going, to paint really my, seem... I'm going to paint my butt gold. Share it. I was like, hey, I got a booty over here. God. Oh <laughs> my fucking god. <laughs> that is so fucking smart and dumb at the same time. <laughs> so what's ah. going to happen? Is they're going to fly at you at Super Saiyan three. Right into your rectum. <laughs> Super Saiyan th three inches. Oh, oh God! Everyone at home, we're so sorry. <laughs> I apologize for nothing. <laughs> Just for one golden pube. <laughs> oh, so, what? What am I rolling there? <laughs> um, we're gonna have to go find some gold paint first. We can synthesize it. This is futuristic spaceship. Are you kidding me? Well, it's all broken right now, too. Broken. Your ship it's all broken. over the, your ship we, is all but, over the crater. But we have powerful shields to prevent that, though. Yeah, but it's broken. That's that's canon now. Yeah, we we came out of warp. Shields ain't gonna stop a planet. Yeah, the shield the up. shield is the reason you're not all over the crater. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Um. Okay. Instead of paint, how about I find some like gold doubloons or gold coins, put them on my butt crack. No, then they just take it off. You want them in there? <laughs> we'll melt them down and cover your ass like it's a fucking uh, a, a skull piece. Um, oh my God. As as a scientist, I, I I I highly I gotta highly like say that's a bad idea. But I'm gonna do it anyway. <laughs> All right. Your plan is to go and so oh, here's your plan. You need to charter a ship and find some tr booty to dig up. Can't we steal some of their shit? Yeah, like I'm assuming that would piss them off even more. And get their attention. Oh, how are you going to steal what's your plans for stealing their treasure? The from the guys fighting above you. We go out riding horses. Oh yeah, the horses. They're probably awake by now. I wanna to... ride the horses to their base camp and <clears throat> Cosmic's gonna sleep with them. Yes. I thought oh. we were trying to find their gold. Yeah, we gotta find their. Yeah. I mean, hey, if, there's, if the boss is at the base camp, I'll sleep with them, all right? Sleep with the boss. Sleep with the boss. Yep, yeah, see? I have no idea what your plan is anymore. You've changed it so many times. It's okay. <laughs> Just roll with it. <laughs> what are we even trying to do right now? We're trying to are... get their attention so that. We can he tried to have sex with the aliens. <laughs> they're they're gonna go out and try to distract him while I work on the um on the ship so that I can teleport the crystals out of their rectums. All right, Scotty, you start working on the ship. The I other one of you, are you trying to are you trying to steal gold so you can melt it on your ass still? Well, I'm gonna stick yes. I'm gonna stick around to, to power the ship if I need to. Yes, I'm still trying to steal gold so I could. 
And I I'm said, his back while he and, I said this, and I said, I said, this said this, to dig up the gold, you're going to need to find some treasure. Yep. But and and if they're pirates, they should have a mushroom? treasure map in their. Uh, oh, there, there should be some, there should be some sort of treasure around here somewhere. They're okay, fighting for you're gonna, you're, you're going to look for a treasure map at their camp. I understand you now. Yeah. Yes. Okay, Scotty, you start working on repairs. You get to roll one d six because. Repairs. You got your work cut out for you. Four. <laughs> no, wouldn't it, wouldn't he have a uh, expert too? Since he's an engineer, he didn't train him what to do when the ship was this destroyed. Up. You know what? That is, yeah, okay. <laughs> I rolled a four. You begin. You roll up your sleeves and you very slowly begin repairing it. 